cranial cervical flexion test is used to assess the patient's ability to recruit and utilize the deep neck flexors. While supine, place a blood pressure cuff beneath the lordotic curve of the patient's cervical spine. I suggest handing the patient the sphygmomanometer so they can assess and observe maintenance of the proper pressure range. Inflate the blood pressure cuff to 20 millimeters of mercury to begin the test. Once there, have the patient perform a cervical nod to, tw to increase the pressure to 22 millimeters of mercury. Maintain this position for 10 seconds. After 10 seconds, the patient can relax for 10 seconds. Next, have the patient repeat the cervical nod increasing the pressure to 24 millimeters of mercury. Have the patient rest again for 10 seconds. You will repeat this maneuver, increasing by an increment of two millimeters of mercury per level with an on and off phase of 10 seconds each. The test continues until the patient achieves the 30 millimeter mercury level or until failure of the test. Failure of the test occurs when the patient recruits the superficial neck flexors, which include the hyoid muscles, the platysma, or the sternocleidomastoid. The patient also may fail the test when they are unable to, to achieve or a decrease in 20% is noted in the desired level for pressure.